In DeFi, our money is controlled by us, the user, while the apps we use are often created by different teams who share one common thread, the blockchain. And in most cases, that's Ethereum. Now, the first tool you need in DeFi is a wallet that interacts with smart contracts and DeFi apps so you can tell the app to do things for you. So let's look at those. MetaMask is the most popular of these wallets and it works as a Chrome extension on your browser. And that means you can go to a website, click on buttons to send small amounts of ETH in exchange for the app doing things like trading, lending, borrowing, or sending your money. And it works just as a little pop-up window, you sign a transaction, and then that's how it works. And MetaMask will also allow you to store your wallets and crypto assets on Ethereum. There are alternatives to MetaMask like Argent, Monolith, the Coinbase wallet, and Gnosis Safe, to name a few. Secondly, we need a tool to track your on-chain portfolio. And that's where tools like Zappa, Zerion, and DeBank come in handy. Now, each of these offers a DeFi dashboard by simply connecting your wallet and stringing together all of your money into a more traditional portfolio view like you'd find in banking apps. But again, without requiring your ID or any personal information, it just looks at your wallet address and says, this is what you have and this is what you can do. Finally, information is power. Knowing where you can borrow, where you can provide liquidity, where you can automate yield farming and more, is key. And that's probably why you're watching DeFi 101. Now, DeFi moves quickly, so just keeping up on information with the DeFi will help you stay updated on new opportunities. But just bear this in mind, your money is yours. It's mobile, it can go wherever the best opportunities are. And no one can stop you because it's permissionless. And the key takeaway here is knowing how to store your assets, how to interact with dApps using a Web3 Ethereum wallet, and then knowing where to go to try all these new applications releasing in DeFi. You've been watching DeFi 101, do be sure and check out the other videos in the series and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the new videos as they drop. And above all, stay safe out there.